hello guys it's good to have you back and in this tutorial i'll be showing you how you can send signals from your meta 5 to telegram with zero code though you'll be needing a software i will show you how you can install the software on your meta 5 it is very easy to use i once did a video explaining how you can do this exam exact same thing but i missed a lot of things i left out a lot of details which means the video was not valid but in this particular video i've made the corrections to this so make sure you watch this video from the beginning to the end at the end of this video you'll be able to take treats on your meta 5 and the and the signal will automatically be sent from MetaTrader 5 to Telegram without you needing to do anything. All you just need is the software and make sure you watch this video from the beginning to the end. And if at the end of this video you find it helpful, make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel to motivate me more to drop similar content like this. So the first thing you have to do is to navigate to your Telegram. Once you get to Telegram, go to this search section and search for bots father make sure there is no space between the bot and the father make sure it is written together bot father click on this verified account not this click on the verified account once you click on the verified account then you can see this chart this chart as loaded then go to click on start once you click on start you can see you have various options here right now the next thing you have to do is to click on this new bot once you click on new bot read this message it says all right, a new bot. How are we going to call it? Please choose a name for your bot. Then you can choose a name and say, um, let me just name this YouTube MT5 bot, right? Once you do that, click on send. Once you click on send, you can see it's saying, good. Now let's choose a username for your bot you know once you when you open a social media account you have the display name and you have the username let's assume that the first name that we input here youtube mt5 bot is like our display name now we also need the username if you read the message sent by telegram here it said it says good now let's choose a username for your bot it must end with bot like this for example tetris bot or tetris underscore bot the next thing you have to do now is just to come here you can just say youtube mt5 underscore bot once you do that you have to make sure that it ends with underscore bot once you are done with that then click on send once you click on send automatically you got a me you get a message saying done congratulations on your new bot you will find blah 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 now you can see that you sent a congratulatory message saying you successfully created your telegram bot now you can see here that we have various link this is a link to the bot which you are going to be sending to your clients i will explain more on that later and also take note of this token even if you have to save it somewhere because as this video progresses we are still going to use it after you successfully created your telegram bot then click on this link which is the link to your bot and also this is the link you'll be sending to your clients click on it once you click on it automatically it's going to load this page for you then click on start once you click on start now go to your browser right once you go to your browser go to api this is it api.telegram.org slash bots then after this bot you can see here we have api.telegram.org slash bots bot now in front of this bot you go back to your telegram go back to your to bot father now you can see here that when you created the bot they also added a token you can see the token here so copy the token once you copy the token go back to your browser now in front of the of this bot paste the token once you paste the token you can see here we have telegram api.telegram.org slash bots then followed by the token slash get updates once you are done with that click on enter once you click on enter you can see this page pop up right now the next thing you will do you can see here that in front of 
update underscore Heidi. We have this number, right? We also have here message, blah, blah, blah. We also have this number. Now, this number in front of ID is what you will copy. Do not copy the ID that you can see here, this 94 blah, 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 in front of update ID. No. Make sure the one that you copy is the one in front of message ID or from. The number is what you are going to copy. Just copy the number. Once you copy the number, make sure you save it somewhere because you will also still need it later on in this video. Now, once you are done with that, go back to your Telegram. Go back to your bot, right? Now, once you go back to your bot, the next thing is for you to go to your MetaTrader 5. Once you go to your MetaTrader 5, then activate the Telegram bot. I will drop a link in the description to the website where you can get this Telegram software. Once you activate, once you want to, once you click and drag the Telegram bot to your charts, then you can see that it has two input parameters. It's asking you to input your token and your chart ID. The first thing is the token. Now go back to your met, go back to your Telegram under bot father. Copy the token again that you generated earlier. Copy it. Go back to MetaTrader Five and paste it in front of token. The next one is your chat ID. Remember the chat ID that I said you should save somewhere earlier. The one in front of um, the message underscore ID from the ID. Just copy the number. Once you copy the number, go to your MetaTrader 5 and paste it in the chat ID um, input parameter. So once you are done inputing your token and your chat ID, click on OK. Once you click on OK, it means the bot is now showing on your chart, right? Now, the next thing you have to do is that let me minimize my screen so that I'll be able to see both the Telegram and the MetaTrader 5 on the, my chart. Now, go to back to the bot. You can see here bot YouTube MT5, YouTube MT5 bot, right? You will see that anytime I place a trade, the signal will automatically be sent to my meta trade to my telegram but there's something very important that you must do first and the thing is that you have to navigate to tools once you go to tools go to options once you get to options come here and type in https colon slash slash api dot telegram dot org i already have that but i already have that before okay once you are done typing it then the next thing is for you to click on ok that it is very important for you to add it make sure you do please and please without that it will not work and make sure you click on allow web request for listed url make sure you click this box and input this http api.telegram.org once you are done with that let's say for example i want to place a buy trade um let me say i want to place a buy trade let me just place the trade here i accept okay if i place a buy trade automatically you can see that the signal has been sent to my meta trader five now, in case of multiple trades, that is why you can see here that it also added a ticket. The ticket is like a unique number for the for you, for your um, subscribers to be able to see which trade is it that maybe you modified or you closed or blah, blah, blah. For example, if I modify it, maybe, let me say I change, I want to add a take profit. If I add take profit to it, it's going to send a message again, signal to your clients that you've modified the trade now you can see that now we have take profit initially take profit was known and sl was known now we have take profit now if i go ahead again and i change the stop loss let me modify the stop loss you will get the message again that the stop loss that you've modified the trade sl and tp modified you can see here that we have um we have a modified signal and also have a ticket attached you can see that the first one i sent the ticket was the same as the second one was the same as the third one so that the the 
clients will be able to trace the um the trade that you just modified for example if i go ahead and enter like a sell trade you see that now the ticket will be different you can see that now we have a different ticket you can see this is the ticket we have here you can see that the number the ticket is different from this and you can see that the bot also says the tickets of the number the symbol volatility 10 1 s the type the lot size the current price the which means which is the which is like the entry price the stop loss is also there the take profit is also there so now once the bot is activated or attached to your account you can go ahead and place trade on any other chart for example let's say i want to place trade on another chart entire another symbol entirely let's say um like boom 1000 right if i go ahead and say you know that the bot is not attached to the chart but it will still work why because the bot is already has already been attached to the account i can just go ahead and say buy once i click on buy i will still get can you see now i i, I will still get a signal from the telegram bot uh from the bot from mt5 that on that same account i've just imp i just entered another trade you can see that boom 1000 index all the details of the trade was also attached to it now this next part is very important because without you understanding this next part your clients will not be able to use this you will not be able to receive signals even if they have the link to the bot now go back to your bot father once you go back to bot father then copy the link you know this is the link to the bot right you will send it to your clients this is the link you send to your clients make sure you copy it but for the because the clients have access to this link does not mean they will have access to your signal right this is what you will tell your client so that they'll be able to have access to your signal tell your client to make sure they have a username if they don't have a username on their telegram tell them to go to your to their profile once they get to their profile make sure they edit edit their profile and they have a username you can see for example my username is abio israel Kbalumi. for anyone that does not have a username you can just come here then decide to change the username or set a new username make sure your clients have a username now once they have the username the next thing is for you to tell them to go to the search i to search section of telegram and search for tele gram raw telegram bot raw tell them to search for telegram bot raw once they search for telegram bot raw you can see this this tr click on it once they click on it then they should navigate to start click on start once they click on start this will pop up right now you see that they also have this id you see that we have different id we have message id blah 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 but the id you will ask your client to click on is this particular id the one in front of from from then id then this is what they will copy and send to you once they send it to you then you will go back to your metatrader 5 once you go back to your metatrader 5 then you open you can open any random chart on your metatrader 5 any random chart on your metatrader 5 then activate the bot right once you activate the bot go back to your meta go back to your telegram once you go to your telegram go to your bot father and copy the token again the token you generated for the bot now copy it here once you copy it here the token then after that the id that your client sends to you then paste it here for example you can see that when i opened um raw data bots then i copied i got this id the you know we have different id there's one in front of update underscore id message underscore id then we have one that they wrote from then id the, it is the one in in the curly brackets in front of from the id the number is what you are going to copy well, the the number is what your client is going to copy and send to you once your client send it to you then you come to this chat id paste it then click on ok once you click on ok it means your the client has been registered with you 
which means anytime you don't want the client to receive your signals again from that bot what you need to do all you just need to do is to come here and remove it so you can open many chats different chats for different um, you can open different chats for different clients just make sure that they are registered in your meta on your meta trader 5 on any random chat whatsoever so anytime their subscription is over and you don't want them to have access to your signals again all you just need to do is to remove the bot that has their um the, the bots that has their chat id you know for example here we have we've opened different chats right and for different clients now the one that the chat that you activated the bot and you added their chat id is the one you are going to remove from your meta trader 5 once you remove it from your meta trader 5 they won't receive signals again and it's very important for you to send the link of the bot to them once you send the link of the bot to them and they click on it then once they click on need and they click on start like you did like i explained to you earlier they will start receiving the signals but if you did not register them on your meta trader 5 it means even if they click on start they will not receive your signals so anytime their subscription has expired all you just need to do is to do what go to the chat where you activated their own name their chat id check it just come there go to properties of the bot check it if their chat id is the one there all you do all you just need to do is to come here click on it then remove which means they won't receive signals again even despite having access to the telegram bot or the link that you sent to them so that is it guys if you want to get this telegram bot this software that i use you can click on the link in the description or in the comment section which i drop in the comment section or in the description it will take you to the website where you can purchase the software and be able to use it so if you find this video helpful make sure you subscribe to this youtube channel like this video share with your friends and comment subscribe for more bye guys